Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Fonte over here on another video. In this one, guys, I'm going to be comparing an iPhone 6S running iOS 7.3.2 to an iPhone 6S running iOS 11.4 beta 3, guys. So as always, stay tuned. All right, guys, so we're gonna put up both devices here. This is the one running iOS 10.3.3, this is the one running iOS 11.4 beta 2, beta 3, guys, sorry. So let's see if beta 3 didn't prove anything here. So both phones are really fast in booting up, guys, though iOS 10 is still faster, usually booting up devices till now, sadly. So it seems faster and the difference is like two to three seconds. So let's just enter the phones. See if any animation lag there. Okay, both are smooth. All right, guys, so both phones have nothing running in the background here. Let's just start the test. So first up, calendar. Was faster than iOS 11. Good stuff there, going for camera. Identical, going for maps. Okay, loading the map itself was faster than iOS 10. Clock was about the same, going for weather. Uh, same, guys, going for phone. Was actually faster than iOS 11, going for App Store. Uh, yeah, slightly faster than iOS 11 as well, guys. Going for Safari here. Okay, loading that page itself was faster than iOS 10, guys. Going for, say, iPads. And so, okay, was identical there. And now, guys, for some third-party apps here, going for Geekbench 4. And I think it was a throw there, guys, going for Subway Surfers here. Let's see if there's any difference. Okay, loading bar appears first here. Okay, definitely, uh, wow. iOS 10 was super snappy, guys. But then iOS 11 wasn't slow, but iOS 10 was clearly faster there, guys, going for Temperant 2. I mean, I love the speed on the iOS 10 here, loading. Wow, definitely iOS 10, guys, but then this time iOS 11 was closer. And the difference there, guys, is minimal. Going out, going for Mario Run. Though, guys, I want to say that this phone is like three, this is the third iOS on it, and it's still super fast. I mean, yeah, okay. Maybe iOS 11 was faster, actually, loading Super Mario. Mario Run here, guys, going for Instagram. And that's an important app for you guys, and okay. It was actually slightly faster than iOS 10, though. It was super fast on both guys, blazing fast. You won't really feel the difference there. Going for Google Earth, identical. Great performance there, solid performance on both uh, iPhone 6s's here. Going for the benchmark. Oh, wow, that was faster there on iOS. 11 guys, going for YouTube guys. YouTube seems identical, it actually was identical guys on both, really good performance there, even on iOS 11, so iOS 11 doesn't really affect iPhone 6s yet, which is a good thing. All right guys, now for some RAM management. Calendar, camera, maps, clock, weather, phone dialer, App Store, Safari, Geekbench 4, Subway Surfers, Temperant 2, Super Mario, Instagram, Google Earth, good stuff there, and to the benchmark, Okay, I feel like I'm to benchmark I have to refresh on iOS 11. Not sure, guys, though. Because this weird animation happens to us to benchmark sometimes. Going for YouTube. Mm, both did a great job, guys. Now, guys, for a Geekbench 4 test. Alright, guys, so here you have the scores. So the iPhone and iOS 11.4 BR3 did score actually, uh, score actually better this time, guys. So uh, eight higher than single core, it's random though guys, but just shows you that uh, there's no problem with the scores guys. Which is a good thing here to see. Yeah, basically, both single core and multi-core score did well. Now guys, for a final test here and to the benchmark, let's just, just here start a test.
All right, guys, so here you have the scores. So there is some difference. So iOS 10, the score actually higher here, guys. For some for some reason, the screen is dim here on, the, on this phone. Though the battery life was better on iPhone, this phone as well. So everything was better on iOS 10. So this phone lost more, like 4% more in this test than the iOS 10 phone. I can show you the scores here, guys. The CPU was slightly better on I, uh, iOS 11. GPU was better on iOS 10. UX and RAM were both better on iPhone. 6s running iOS 11.10.3.2 uh, guys. All right, guys. So that was the comparison between I iPhone 6s running iOS 10.3.2 and the one running iOS 11.4 beta 3. Once again, guys, the battery life is still better on the one on iOS 10. Sadly, guys, as well as performance, everything is still better, guys. So even though some people said that 11.3 11.4 beta 3 is more stable, fix a lot of issues with lag, but still, guys, it's not stable. So um, if you're on iOS 10, just I don't know guys, it's still better, everything guys, battery life, performance, even RAM, I'm not sure, maybe this phone didn't refresh into the benchmark, multitasking, the iOS 10 didn't refresh anything guys. So if you like the video guys, like it, suggest other videos, subscribe for more content, peace out.